Catch that man! Catch that man! Mr. President! Oops. Excuse me. I'm not employed. I must thank you. I'm happy now because of you. Haha. <laughs> yes, at the end of the day, music is my life. I'm happy to be poor. I don't need anyone's approval. I'll live my life with music. Haha. <laughs> I think he just kissed us with his eyeball? Or I kissed him on the cheek? It's a little weird, uh, admittedly. He looks kind of hurt. Yeah, I think you I think you damaged him. <laughs> with those Grish? lips, of course. It's like a registered weapon. <laughs> Christ almighty, Chu. Take it easy, pal. <laughs> Music is the love of my life. And that was that. By the way, hello everyone and welcome back to more Stephen Amount Play Tulip. Mao and I are in great moods. Great moods! We feel great! We feel wonderful! And the reason we feel wonderful is because we never have to go back to Funny Bone City. Hooray! We never have to go back to the factory. We never have to do any of that stuff. We get all the kisses, everything is set, and we're back in Long Life Town. So we just arrived, we talked to Batanyam. Because we had fired him from before, we get the kiss. Um, also, we know things get a little confusing uh, with episodes 16 and 17, because we actually took three, maybe even four episodes and kind of combined them all into two. Um, and they kind of confused what, like, who was playing the game. Now we're back to normal. Now we're back to Mao's evens and I'm odds. So today is episode 18. Mao's playing the game. We're going to see Mr. Suzuki. Uh, because we got another important thing back. So you need to go have a chat. Oh, player. Chu, welcome. I think you have to walk over I, to yeah. him and give him the thing. Please come closer. Love I paper. Have a, I have a paintbrush shoved in my skull. What? That is the love paper. Thank you, Chu. Hmm, I see, I see. You're president of the Funny Bone Factory. Mr. Saito was very happy about it. A successful career? It might be one form of happiness for some people. Oh, well, very, very well done, very well done. Chew, I'm counting on you to get the rest of the leather set. And that means that we've comple uh, com completed the chapter. I was trying to s I, I said complenished. Finished and completed. We've complenished, Mao. We complenished this. We have. Once again, no subtitles. Courtesy of Natsume. Thanks. Thanks. We have no idea what that says. Uh, actually, on the last one, someone translated it for us. So if you're watching this and you can translate that, please do. And if you're watching this and you're confused, go in the comments and see if someone has translated it for us. Thanks in advance, by the way. Good morning, wake up. So, Mal, we've gotten like a piss load of kisses, so... We have, but we'll have to save again to see what we got. And we need to do that. Okay, well, should you talk to him first, though, and see if... You There's anything get... in the newspaper? Yeah. Yeah, because we're still trying to get the dentures, right? Uh-huh. Read the paper. Read the third story. According to the paper, a shiny UFO was observed above Scarecrow Field. And recently, it was seen above Long Life Town! I want to see it, too. I wish I had a telescope. Trouble, big trouble. So he already told us that before. Which is not very helpful. Uh, so now you're going to go to bed. Yes. Even though we just got home. We've had a lot of kisses. We do. Someone actually said that they thought it'd be funny if if Chu's dad progressively got less and less interested at this point. Until he was just very nonchalant, like, eh. Everyone's talking about Chu. I'm so worried about my son's reputation, sort of. I, I can't sleep. Let's see... Today, Chu kissed? Daniel, wow. And Robot King, oh, that's nifty. Boxman? Christ, Chu, this is a lot of J Son, this is a lot of people. Jigsaw? Mecha Yadzilla? I don't even know what that is. That's five worker. But, son, you can't just go around kissing all these people. I'm, I'm very disappointed. This is com confusing and perplexing. Diddy? Lover's tree, lover's tree. My son has successfully kissed for, like, the 30-somethingth time. 
That means Chu has kissed 38 times in his whole life. Fantastic, I shall strengthen his heart. Now his reputation will be better too. It's a heart kiss cannon. It's a lot of power. Chu has reached level nine. He has become a frisky man. <laughs> Keep trying and become a man with a strong heart. The next goal is 12 kisses. Lover's tree, I mean, thanks. Thanks, I, I, mean, I see. Yeah, all right, mm-hmm. Okay. All right, good night, Chu. Yeah, I think at this point, because I, I don't think I can I can push any further on Dad being, like, crazy. Yeah. Because at that point, it's just inaudible, un unintelligible screams, so I think I'm going to start going the other way until he becomes completely uncaring. Good morning, wake up. Meh. She was actually a cat. Meow. You find out later in the game. I wonder if the paper changed. Uh, hey, Dad. <laughs> I'm not convinced the paper's ever changed. According to the paper. Ah, uh, it's the same thing. So, it's just completely random. When he'll tell you the story, Mal? I don't know when it triggers. Okay. But, uh, let's save. Oh, we also get a chance to see what the, the icon is. For Frisky Man. Oh, goodness. See, I feel like I'm also level 9. Because I'm a... I'm a Frisky Man. <laughs> it's... Never mind. Alright, so, now we're back in Long Life Town. We never have to go back to Funny Bone City. What, what's our agenda, Mal? Well... We... Did you want to check the mailbox? Oh yeah, I wanted to check the mailbox. Thanks for reminding me. I'm the best reminder. Very shabby. What's in here? There is a letter. Dear sir, I practice with local junior high swimming team now. Everyone there is talking about you. I heard people call you Frisky Man these days. I broke my personal record the other day. Chew, good luck, Swimmer Daniel. Oh. Thanks, Swimmer Daniel. You the best. Okay, so uh, what's the agenda? Well... We need to work on this kiss. And it's my favorite, favorite one in the game. Miss Zombie Mika. Okay, and you said work on, which implies that it is there's going to be... There's a lot of work. Okay, so there's a lot of work to get this this specific kiss. Yes. But the, the, you're excited about it, so that must I mean am. that it doesn't involve spending three hours trying to pick frogs out of a trash can. Well, we need to go to Worldly Desire Temple. And I thought it would be a good time to try for some frogs. Um, it would be, because and we still don't have it. Because we can't get to her till 2 a.m. Okay. So I thought it was a good time to go do that. Okay, so we'll we'll raid the trash can, see if we can uh, get a hold of anything, basically. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> he wouldn't have any of that sass. All right, let's jump ahead to uh, the frog trash can. All right, here goes something. I was, part of me was like, I wonder if it'll just be empty right <laughs> off the get-go. All right, so one big poop seems okay. We're going for frogs, folks. We're going for frogs. Um, we still have not gotten the frogs we need. We've got a hot sweet potato. Well, that's something. Come on, frog. Please be frog. It's another old umbrella. Hooray! Okay. Well, not for frogs. Still have not gotten the... Th okay, it's another hot sweet potato. I should mm. eat one of the cold ones. Uh, yeah, or two. I think they only give you two health, right? They do. Man, there was a time in the game where that was a lot of health. You remember that? Yes. Like, a long time ago, that meant, that meant something. That made a difference. And now... Times have changed. All right. Get back in that garbage can, Chew. Garbage can. Do 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 us a solid. Pick out the poop in the garbage can. Someone is pooping in the garbage Ugh. can, and I'm not sure who it is, but it seems problematic. All right, go for it. Go for the gold. Go for the gold, buddy. It's a teapot, which is something we can sell, but it's not a. There's not. Like we're not even finding frogs. It's empty. Now someone did give me the comments, and I'm gonna try it is they said that if you go down into the cave, it resets.
going into the cave, going into the the temple, going down here and coming back up, that does not reset the trash can. So whoever left that comment was mistaken. Um, because we had tested this before, and what we found was that it had... It was 24 hours. You had to wait a full 24 hours from whenever you got the stuff to get it. There also may be a, a part of the day, like a, a specific time where things reset, but I'm not sure. Also, why are you over here? This is where we need to be. Oh. We have about 12 hours. Oh, good. So we just got to sit here for six minutes. Okay. That there she is. is. Very frightening. You just run into it. Uh. Hi. Okay. Hi, welcome. It's been a while since I had the last customer. My name is Mika. Nice to meet you. Please make yourself at home. Uh. Hey, do you want some tea? Really? I'm so happy. I'll bring it right away. Uh, poor girl can't hold her head up. Ouch. Yeah. Good God. So? Did you like it? It was delicious. That's good. Okay. Now I know I'm still pretty good. Look how happy Chu is. He does. He appears happy. Hey, can you listen to me? I died. In a little accident. I prayed hard that I didn't want to die. Then my wish came true. It's a little inconvenient. But I'm happy to be alive. Sorry. I talk too much. Come again anytime. And that's our first meeting with Zombie Mika. Uh... Okay. Automatically at four, it does this. It's about time. See you later. Hallucinating in the graveyard for two hours. That's what I just did. So... Okay. That uh, happened. Gotta catch the train. Rope. Yeah, that happens. You... Okay. Now we need to go back to Long Life Town and start fetch quests. Do they have anything to do with Zombie Mika or they no? They do. Um, we have to go get things, so we might as well do them now and heal. Because it's a good time with only like 50 hearts. and We have to see her a certain amount of times, and every time we see her, we get progressively more hurt. Oh. One of them does 59 hearts of damage. Oh. Okay, so um, we're going to wait on the train, and then what's next? Um, we're going to go straight to Scarecrow Field first. Okay. And then we need to go collect two things. Okay, well, uh, onward to Scarecrow Field. And here we are in Scarecrow Field. So why are we here? We have to collect two things from here. And um, um, Okay. One of them is way back in this corner. We got to go to like, the top left part of the map. Uh, okay. Up and, here. and then also, also at some point we got. There it is. What, what is that? That is La Lavender. La Lavender. Okay. Now what do we need? We need some fresh mint. Fresh mint. I'm assuming at some point we'll figure out what that strange glowing yeah. face rock is. Yeah. Oh, that's the 20 year old guy, the chair one. I like how he comes up in a chair and then it disappears as he walks away. The fresh mint is right here. Okay, so you got fresh mint. And we have a little bit of time, so let's check out this plastic bucket. What appears in the bucket? It's empty. <laughs> Is there something that does appear? It's a trash can, like a normal trash can. Okay, and we we still are in the process of getting the 50 
walk across is for this guy, right? Yeah, I thought I'd do a little bit right now while I wait for the train. Okay, well, I'm not going to make everyone else watch this, so what are we cutting ahead to? We are going to cut ahead to getting back to Long Life Town. We need to get one more item there. Okay, let's go do that. And we are back at the park. Um, this is what we need. Should we check in on the guy digging the hole? Yeah, we can check on him. That's Yamada, right? Yeah. My stupid, stupid, stupid life. What is my happiness? Okay, so he's doing well. So what was it that you picked up? I wasn't paying attention. It was the wilting flower. It was behind the slide. So now you have three things. What was the purpose of that? Um, we will need them to give to um, Miss Zombie Mika's lover. Okay. <laughs> so we have to go see her again at 2 a.m. We have to see her three times in a row before we go find her lover. So is that the next stop or are you... Um, I thought I might sell some of the things I have with Chaypot. Okay. And then I thought I might save and heal and maybe pick up some food and then go to Worldly Desire Temple. Okay. But after all that, the next stop is Worldly Desire Temple. Yes. All right. Let's cut back to that now. It's two o'clock and we are back for Zombie Mika. Part two. Part two. Mass sold some stuff and uh, checked at home to, uh, to rest. I also picked up some food. And some food. Thank you for coming again. I'm so happy! I practiced making tea since you came last time. I know it's better than last time, but... Do you want to taste it? You'll taste it for me? I'm happy. Give me a second. I'll show you how it's done. Uh... <laughs> What is she putting in there? He leaves. What else would she put in there? Uh, well, based on how much damage it's doing, God only knows, Mel. Her arm just fell off. Ah. Look at Chu's face. <laughs> 44. Ouch. Dear God. You okay there? I might have lost my touch. But it should still taste good. How is it? Delicious. That's good. You do have to say delicious. I think it's almost coming back to me. Thank you very much. Hey, can you listen to me again? My hobby is making tea. Really? You guessed? It's surely obvious, I guess. I liked a boy a long time ago. He loved tea. He got me into tea, actually. How simple is that? <sighs> Sorry, I talked too much again. Come back whenever you want. Okay. Um, just gonna, gonna chill over here, next to this tree. It's about time. See you later. Once again, Chu awakes from the Worldly Desire Temple Graveyard at 4 in the morning. Alright, Mal, uh, we are out of time for this episode, but what can the viewers look forward to on the next episode? Well, we need to see Zombie Mika some more. We just see her two more times. Okay. We need to go give the things we collected, the La Lavender, the Fresh Mints, the Wilting Flower, and then something else to her boyfriend. And we can also maybe check on getting some frogs while we're here. Really hope we can manage to get those frogs. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to come back next time for more Steven Amal play Tulip. You should make a wish when you see a shooting star. It'll come true. What's my wish? S-E-C-R-E-T. Look, what is that? So that's the UFO we've been hearing about on the third page of the news, right? Yep. Maybe, possibly a UFO. Wow.